Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Dyson. I'm back with another banger of a video. And today we're going to be talking about Darkseid versus Gore the God Butcher. So yeah, without further ado, let's get it. So Gore the God Butcher is going to be one of the main villains of Thor Love and Thunder. He is a god killer. And the sword that he possesses is the same sword that Null used to go on a rampage against the gods. It's called the Necro Sword, All Black, aka the God Slayer. It's one of the most powerful weapons in the known universe in the MCU and in Marvel Comics. Gore is literally a slaughterer of the gods. His vow is that all gods will die. He lived a life of tragedy after tragedy before he realized that the gods just were ignoring his prayers. At first, he chose to believe they didn't exist until he saw two of them fighting. He killed one of them and took All Black off of him. From that point forward, he became Gore the God Butcher, slaughtering, massacring entire pantheons of gods. He's strong enough to literally implant his sword into a planet and completely obliterate it with the energy of the Necro Sword All Black. Now we don't know much about the MCU version of Gore, but we do know a lot about him in the comics. He's able to kill multiple versions of Thor, slay many gods, and conquer like Darkseid. Darkseid is actually a conqueror of worlds. He's the lord, overlord that is, of the planet Apocalypse. He's strong enough to create craters in the earth with one swing of his axe. And while combining all three of the mother boxes, he can just use its power to cleanse a planet with fire. His omega beams are so powerful they can outright evaporate just about anybody. And the beams can also teleport his victims. Darkseid's signature weapon is his axe. His axe has three blades on the back and one very sharp blade in the front. At the end of the handle of the axe is two blades. Darkseid actually used this weapon as a mortal living being to kill a green lantern. Gore, the God Butcher, stands at around 6'7", but Darkseid stands at around 8'9". Darkseid is even more powerful and skilled than Steppenwolf, and Steps could fight Doomsday himself, the OG version. So without further ado, let's get into the fight. Keep in mind, Darkseid will have the Omega effect in this fight. Now let's begin. Gore approaches Darkseid as Darkseid walks forward, holding his axe in one hand. He charges and roars out and slams his axe down as Gore takes All Black, extending it out from his arm, and then slashes at Darkseid. Darkseid's axe blade meets that of the Necro Sword and causes a huge wave of energy to form around the both of them in a shock wave as then Gore kicks Darkseid sliding his feet back as he flies backwards he then charges again and throws his axe directly at Gore Gore simply slashes it out of the way with his sword and causes it to stick in the ground as he then charges very fast and leaps into the air coming down with his sword ready to stab Darkseid as Darkseid shoots his omega beams Gore lands on the ground and blocks him with his sword before slashing Darkseid across his chest. He goes to stab Darkseid through the chest, but Darkseid leaps over him, grabs his axe, turns around, and then wails it directly at Gore as Gore then slashes Darkseid's chest open. Darkseid punches Gore in the face and then uppercuts him. Energy pulsates through Darkseid as Gore stabs and slashes at Darkseid and then he takes a tentacle wrapping it around Darkseid's throat and begins choking him. Darkseid <laughs> burns off the tentacle with his omega beams and then grips Gore up by his throat slamming him into the ground as he slams his axe down. Gore dodges this blow blocking it with his sword before slashing at Darkseid's throat. Darkseid backs up dodging this attack effectively as he then shoots his omega beam. The omega beams pierce directly through Gore's chest, dropping him to his knees. Darkseid walks up and grips Gore up by his throat as he's then stabbed through the chest with the sword. Gore pulls the sword out and goes to slash at Darkseid. Darkseid blocks it with his axe, but the axe is cut directly in half as he's slashed. He then stabs him with the blades in his axe handle straight through his chest and shoots him through the skull with his omega beams, killing him. Winner. Dark side. It's been your boy Dyson. And I'm Audi.